This Twitch streamer apparently got banned for her Chun Li cosplay. She said, I'm fully covered. I don't understand Twitch at Twitch support. How is this sexually suggestive content? Someone replied and said, Can we be a little honest here? There's nothing fully covered about purposely angling your camera at your crotch while adjusting your cosplay for maximum exposure. Are there worse things out there? Yes. Are you lying for sympathy? Also, yes. So apparently in this video that she shows throughout the stream, she like aims the camera lower to like, I don't know, show her whole cosplay. I don't know what was going on because this video doesn't have sound. But even after the camera adjustment, you can see all it does is just show her legs, which should not be enough to get banned on Twitch in my opinion. Especially when you have people like Miss Alinity, who has uh, done all of these things here. Gets away with saying the n-word, gets away with tossing her cat over her shoulder, gets away with kissing her cat while she has vodka in her mouth, gets away with actually sexually suggestive content, gets away with everything that breaks Twitch terms of service. So usually when people have problems with the way Twitch handles things like me, our problem is with the fact that they lack major consistency when they choose who to ban and who not to ban. For example, in this gets away with saying the n-word thing, I've seen her get away with saying the n-word multiple times, but she claims that she didn't say the n-word, she was actually saying something else, but it just sounded like the n-word, right? There have been many other streamers who have said the same thing, where they were like, I actually didn't say the n-word, it just sounded like it, right? Twitch did not give a crap, they banned them anyways. No exceptions with their rule on that, right? She's not banned. The whole vodka thing, that was absolutely disgusting. Tossing her cat over her back like that, I mean, that shit is just not okay. Not only have they not banned Alinity, but they haven't taken any action against her at all ever since that whole cat thing happened a few months ago. And this is exactly why people are moving to platforms like Mixer, because they're hoping for more consistent judging on bans and stuff. We're just asking for some consistency, man. If showing legs like that is enough to get banned, then other people should be getting banned for the way that they dress and behave on their stream like this person right here. Why are they not banned? Or why have they not been suspended at all? We see stuff like this happen time and time again on Twitch. People being confused on why they're banned and even after they find out, they start wondering, what about all these other people who have been doing worse things than you? Why aren't they banned? But yeah, that's pretty much it. It seems like the community is on her side for now. Please like the video if you enjoyed it and subscribe for more. See ya.